I mean, nine days of silence when everybody's talking at you and you're kind of like... <laughs> what makes this such a great film for any age? Uh, I think the fact that uh, love is at the heart of it makes it a, a film accessible for everyone. I think love is a... Love and nurture is a very basic human need. It's love and food and shelter and everybody needs that, so... Yeah. yeah, definitely. Camera techniques and editing, it's all quite fluid and fast. Does this affect the acting experience on set? Ooh, you know what, that's kind of like, and acting, acting is not, it's like that's the only thing you have to do, is to stay in the moment whilst being aware that there's a camera here and a camera here, and there's people talking over there. And people, actually, that's your only job, is to stay in the moment. So I always get quite, I'm very intrigued when actors are like, I need silence. It's like, well, no, the, the why you got hired is despite the noise, you can try and like <laughs> be present. And uh, there was a lot of, uh, I, I think that's fun. Like, I think challenges are fun. And at times, you know, you would arrive on set and it's like, we need to improv this. So every take was different. Um, but those are the fun bits that make you feel like you're earning your job, you know, rather yeah. than just like repeat, saying lines, you know, yeah. you're you're really working and that's, uh, that's good. So. Yeah. Yeah, it was great. I mean, what, what 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 you guys brought on set on on the day it was just beautiful. It's amazing. Yeah. yeah, acting is just not reading lines. It's actually like bringing um, the lines out the page. Yes, and sometimes there were no lines, so we would have to improv literally like at action. Mm -hmm. But the, it almost takes it back to a, a theatre kind of training where that's what you had to do, and so it's good to be able to use skills that I think maybe many actors don't really get to use uh, anymore. So that it, it's really makes you feel like uh, you've done something, you've really achieved something. <laughs> you know? Amazing. How did you get ready to perform before some of the larger performances? I'm trying to look after my voice. Um, not speaking, sometimes I would, I think the longest vocal rest I went on was nine days of not speaking. Oh I had a badge <laughs> that says, shh, I'm on vocal rest. And uh, that was, I mean, nine days of silence when everybody's talking at you and you're kind of like <laughs> writing things on your phone. Uh, that was the, big, the biggest kind of prep, the vocal rest was hard.